And your name is? Ken Morland. Your occupation? Energy analyst. And your chosen subject? The sitcom Red Dwarf. Red Dwarf in two minutes, starting now. What is the title of the first episode broadcast in 1988 in which a radiation leak wipes out the entire crew of Red Dwarf apart from Dave Lister? The end. Yes. In Dimension Jump, Arnold Rimmer meets an alternative version of himself. He's a dashing test pilot for the Space Corps and uses the catchphrase, Smoke me a kipper, I'll be... Back for breakfast. Yes. In his first episode, Crichton tells Lister that he looks forward to watching a soap opera produced by Groovy Channel 27. What's it called? Androids. Yep. Who plays the cat, a life form that evolved from Lister's pet, Frankenstein? Danny jo John Jules. Yep. After Lister loses Rimmer and Starbug to the biologically engineered garbage gobblers in a poker game, he offers to exchange them for a piece of cutlery. What name does he give to it? The Spoon of Destiny. Yes. Rimmer claims to have a BSc, though, rather than Bachelor of Science. What do the letters actually stand for? Bronze Swimming Certificate. Yes. In Future Echoes, Lister thinks he is about to die and complains there's loads of things I've never done. I've never had a prawn vindaloo. I've never read... A book. Yes. In the first two series, Norman Lovett played Red Dwarf's computer, Holly. Which actress took over the role in series three? Hattie Heeridge. Correct. In Give and Take, Rimmer and Crichton think they've rescued a sophisticated medical droid called Asclepius. What is the name of the vending machine they've actually rescued? Snacky. Yes. In Confidence and Paranoia, Holly claims he has just finished reading everything that has ever been written anywhere and that the worst book ever was written by which footballer? Kevin Keegan. Yes. What name does Rimmer give to the glove puppet that he starts talking to after he catches a holo virus? Mr. Flibble. Yep. Which character is played by Claire Grogan in the original series and by Chloe Annett from series seven? Christine Kuchansky. Yes. What is the name of the Gestalt entity that regains existence by combining the minds and personalities of the four main characters? Legion. Yes. What is the slogan on the T-shirt that Rimmer is wearing after all of his anger has been removed by the polymorph, a mutant life form that feeds on negative emotions? Give Quiche a chance. Yes, absolutely. 14 questions, Ken, 14 points. Well done.